All right, tell me what you did for me. <laughs> tell me what you did. Got a little ball fade. You know what I'm Ooh, saying? Shit. Ball fade, a little texture on top. Yes, sir. Got your line. So follow our boy Ray on the description below. Yes, sir. I'm back to the old OG. I'm back to the old OG. Oh, yeah. At this point, you guys have already seen the prank. You guys have already seen me at the barber shop. Some of you may have cried with me. Some of you guys may have screamed with me. But mostly I know some of you guys may have laughed at me. It's been a couple days now. I can say I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm, with, I'm over it. Just watch your back. Hope you guys are enjoying your day so far. And YG West is back. Back in my natural habitat. And let's see what we get into. Alright guys? Peace, man. Shake Just got done filming for what? Crew kicks. Crew kicks. So, oh, you guys. Did the, oh, shoot the dab. The, oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, shoot. Can we make these girl, these random girls dab? Dab, make them dab. Make, 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 girl, make, make them dab. Make them dab. dab. It's so loud. I hope you guys can hear me. Dang. Make them dab. You gotta. They're gonna think we're asking them. They're gonna think we're asking them if they have, like, drugs. Like, I know. Dab. I know. What are you doing? Who we're trying are you, to man? Oh, my God. We're trying to vlog. Tell them. God, oh, I swear to God, they don't turn that oh, shit down. These girls just disappeared. Oh, where did they go? Oh my God, they went. Oh, oh. Ooh. Hey, tell me what you think about my hair, bro. It's the first time they're seeing it. What you think? I think it's sexy as hell. I think I've been telling you to do it for a couple months now. Yeah, he's so. been telling me to get rid of it. Well overdue. But uh, anyways, let's see what else we get into. Hope you guys are having a great day and hit the dab for me right now. Ready? Ready? That's a good video making random people. Dab, dab low key, dude. Let's do it. All right, guys. So we're outside of the potential OVO store. And um, Waji got out, he's gonna go ask when it opens and he's gonna go knock on the door hopefully. I don't know if he's actually like, gonna do it, but... He's like, hey man, do you know when the OVO store opens? Oh, he's gonna get to go inside. Oh my god, Waji's going into the OVO store. Freaking YG West, man. It's because it's YG West Wednesdays. Oh my god, he went in. YG's inside the OVO store. He's the first person who's probably a non worker inside the freaking OVO store. Oh, he came out. What happened? I just went in. There's, is there anything in there? No, they're all building it. I took video footage of it. They're all building it and everything. I was like, oh shoot. There's I was nothing in there. OVO? I was, no, nothing OVO. No logo or it's anything? Just, but it says on the door, it says all delivery, um, go towards the rear. Wow. It's just crazy. I was hoping the girl didn't see, like, it was all just construction. Like, you could walk in there right now. But you didn't talk to anybody? No. Damn. They're all construction workers. They felt like, they thought I worked in there or something, like, because I was just yeah, walking yeah, in, yeah. you feel me? I'll show you guys the footage, man. That was crazy. That was dope. <laughs> OVO. Breaking into OVO store. Right? <laughs> Yo, Kiana. Kai just asked me, what if I walk? I said, what if I walked in there and Drake was in the store? What would you do if you were in the, if Drake was right there when you walked in? I would obviously, I would be like, <laughs> can I get a quick picture and just like, you know, probably say some basic stuff that everyone says because my mind would go blank. But no, what if he told you, get the hell out, like you just told me? If he told what me if he says, out. get the hell out of my store? What would, like, you, what would you do? <laughs> My deepest apologies. My and, walk, deep and walk my ass right out. <laughs> my deepest apologies. I'm so sorry. I'll be like this. Six God is watching. And I'll just leave, bro. No, you know what I want to say to him if I ever meet him? Well, I don't well. want to tell you on camera because someone else is going to say all it. Alright, okay, okay. Two in the morning, my mind is on you. Four in the morning, it still has a move. Hit me to tell me you get off a 10. Come here, I make sure you get off again. 
All of a sudden he wants a burrito bowl. Burrito bowl. When Bur I'm walking on oh. with the rolls. Oh. Every time you see me, you know you, you gotta say hello. Oh I got shoot. Kellos, mellows, oh. Kellos. Lakers is coming hard, but they can't win no mellows. Oh Kellos, shoot. Hello. I gotta guys, feel sorry for you. Guys, oh you gonna do it right now? Hoverboard. Okay, hoverboard. Trying to roll up on me. Okay. Hoverboard. Hoverboard. Trying to see me in my pee. <laughs> okay. <laughs> guys, Stop, I don't know why, but I don't know we why, but we are so fitted right now. Like this guy's so fitted. This guy's so fitted. Yeah, we got we got to go in urban. We got to go in urban. I'm like super fitted right now, and I'll tell you guys why. So just stay tuned. I'm gonna make an official announcement to you guys. So just be on the lookout. We already announced it on my channel. So go to my channel. Oh yeah, go on his channel right now. All of a sudden, but I'm gonna announce it to you guys. So yeah. Bro, he's hitting the quad. Hey, hey, hit the quad. Hit the quad. Hit the quad. Hey, hey, Oh! 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 Hit the quad. 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 Hit the Marna, yay! Say shawa, shawa, mahiya, say shawa. Oh, you open up the window. Oh, huh? Ah! Hey! Oh. Oh. hey. hey. We just met up, met up with the prince himself, Prince of Pakistan. Where we and uh, let's see what else we get into. <laughs> Alright, guys, right now we are in the grove. It's very nice. It's actually very cold. Very, oh, very I love cold. This freaking Christmas but look, it's like very festive. Hey. I really like how festive it is. Well, I still need to tell them. I still need to tell them the announcement what I'm doing. What announcement? Oh this yeah. It's holiday coming soon. It's holiday. My now brother has about it. the OVO store, fam. What's up, guys? All right, I need to talk to you. So, I'm gonna tell you guys the whole announcement thing that I was talking about earlier and what we were talking about. But the craziest thing just happened. Okay. So, let me just start. As you guys know, I'm a huge Laker fan, huge Kobe Bryant fan. Like to me, Kobe, just growing up watching Kobe, just memories and just every single thing, just Kobe, like the Black Mamba. All right, Kobe is just huge to me, and um, childhood, huge to my childhood. And um, he announced, he officially announced today that he's retiring. He officially announced that this is going to be my last season in the NBA, and. Um, and it was crazy, you know, it really it really hit. I was like, oh my gosh, like that's crazy. It's like finally official before it was like, you know, what's going to happen and all that. But there was a liquor game tonight at the Staples Center, which is just down the street, literally down the street from USC, down the street, and um, they're playing the Pacers. So get this. I, as soon as I found out, okay, let me tell you. So every single person that got into the game, they were handed a letter from Kobe Bryant, like a sealed black envelope with a letter from Kobe Bryant and everyone that got that letter, whoever was at the game. Once I found that out, I started tripping. I started looking online. I tried to start to find tickets. Okay, it was this game's at 6.30. Game's already started. I'm still trying to find tickets. I'm texting the group chat. I'm texting all the homies, like my brother, Kai, Shet, like everyone's going crazy. And um, so I checked online, checked online, I checked on Craigslist. I hit some people up, hit other people up. My brother's going, you better go. You have to go. It's Kobe, this iconic, this letter. You have to get the letter. And I'm like, I have to, I have to, because it just so means so much to me. I'm super animated right now, but I finally got, I finally found like super high nose. We finally found a ticket, whatever. I by myself, by, by myself. I hurried up, got it. Keep in mind, it's already halftime now. It's halftime. I hurried up and went like, went down to the Staples Center. So I made it to the game. I, okay, I, I whatever. I rushed, hurry up. I made it to the game. I, I'm so happy. I was like, all right, I, I'm in, I'm in and everything. And um, halftime. So it's like, and they're, they're, uh, they're playing the Pacers, Indiana Pacers. And um, here, let me just show you footage of the, whatever I was able to capture from my phone. So enjoy that. Let me tell you 
the reason I went and what I went for and what and just what it means to me. Let me show you guys. Y'all, y'all ready? Okay. This is what I went for. This letter, this sealed envelope by Kobe Bryant to the Laker family, to the Laker fans, what he meant, what he meant to us, and what we meant to him. And this is huge to me. This is iconic. This is historical. This is just, guys. My like, I I'm so happy that I was able to go. I was so happy that I was able to just get this letter and have it in my hands. And um, and I wanted to share this with you guys. Share this moment, with you guys. I'm opening it up. Let's let's open it up and let's do that. But this is what I meant for and. People are honestly like selling this on eBay now for like hundreds of dollars. I'm like, I would, that's just, if you, if you guys are, that's just, come on. Like this is, I would never even think about selling this. Even if it's just a letter, like I would never even think about. Like this is so iconic and historic. Now I'm just talking so much. Let's open this thing. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yo, this is what I, this is exact. Yo, check this out. I'm sorry. I don't even have my vlog camera. Like, look, I'm all, obviously I'm on my laptop. You guys can't tell. When we first met, I was just a kid, and I was just a kid watching this guy play, watching the... All right, let me read this letter. Let's read this letter. All right. Okay. When we first met, I was just a kid. Some of you took me in, some of you didn't, but all of you helped me become the player and man in front of you today. You gave me confidence to put my anger to good use. Your doubt gave me determination to prove you wrong. You witnessed my fears morph into strength. Your rejection taught me courage. Whether you view me as a hero or a villain, please know I poured every emotion, every bit of passion in my entire self into being a Laker. What you've done for me is far greater than anything I've done for you. I knew that each minute of each game I wore purple and gold. I honor it as I play today and for the rest of this season. My love for this city, this team, and for each of you will never fade. Thank you for this incredible journey, Kobe Bryant. I'm so happy I was able to get my hands on this, you guys. It, this this means it, this is huge, yo. Now let me talk to you guys about the announcement. What I've been trying to tell you guys. Um, so coming this holiday, a new segment. I'm actually trying to start like this whole. F I'm I I love fashion, guys. I love fashion. I love dressing up. Like I like I just you know what I'm saying like I love these house slippers. You feel me? Like I'm just joking. I was I was wearing boots earlier. Hello, hello. Yeah, uh, all right, for sure, Kobe, all right. But anyways, guys, so I'm starting a Waji West Wednesdays, coming to you guys in the holidays. A Waji West Wednesdays, and you know what? Cue the music, cue, cue that music right now. Yeah, cue, cue it. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my God. That's the wrong one. I gotta do everything on my own, man. Was Louis my killer? Was drugs my dealer? What's that jacket, Margiela? But yes, YG West Wednesdays. I'm starting that. It's coming in the winter, the holidays. So stay tuned for that. Uh, shooting the intro video and all. That's all in the works right now. Um, so basically, what it's gonna be is it's gonna be like a fashion segment. It's gonna be whatever I like to dress, whatever, whatever. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Look into my closet, whatever the trends that I like, the trends that I like to get into. How to style this? How to dress this? How to um, how to really and then just feed off you guys whatever you guys want whatever questions you guys want to ask feature this feature that and um that's basically it guys so coming to you guys soon watch us wednesdays where it's for you guys fashion style just trends segment and just why ah. all right guys um i hope you guys enjoy this vlog i hope you guys are excited for what's yet to come you know we're always doing things for you guys we're always trying to push thank you thank you for listening to my story Thank you for sharing this moment with me as I, as my heart's beating, as this letter, as YG West, and just exciting, you know? And um, But uh, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Always, as always, give this vlog a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys think about YG West Wednesdays. If you guys will like it, what you guys will want to see, what I should do, any ideas. And uh, besides that, I love you guys so much. And always, 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 always stay beautiful.